prospects of access to your medical records is coming. And in this episode, I'm going to show you exactly how you can switch it on for your practice in under a minute. Let's take an answer to primary care and learning. So let's show you how to enable patient level prospective record access in system one. To do so, simply go to setup and then click on users and policies and then move down to organization and preferences. When you get to that, you need to find the online services tab that you can see here and then move down towards patient record access. When you click on that, you'll get this menu option here and then you have the choice of how you want to enable record access for your patients. You can either enable summary patient record access, detailed coded record access, or you can also enable the full clinical record access, which is the ask that we are now being asked to do. And in order to do that, simply you select the box and then you get the choice of either all consultations all consultation from the date of consent onwards or consultation from a specific date and you can set that date. Additionally, you can also allow patients to request access to their records via system online, which is system one's online portal. Whether this will continue to happen and change to AirMid, I'm not sure at this point, but that hasn't changed just yet. And that's it. If you do need to redact information in System 1, make sure you check out our video coming up right here that shows you exactly how to do that if there is information that is not safe or sensible for the patient to be able to see in line with your normal processes. Have a look right here.